The CR30 belt adhesion problem. Solved! Hi, T-Rex here, and after having read Steward's grid space write-up, I upgraded my CR30 to linear rails and a volcano-ish hot end. I was now having some serious belt adhesion problems, though. I couldn't get a cube to print and tried everything I could think of. I then remembered Tom's lowered belt printer YouTube video, and the solution came to me change the angle of the nozzle to the bed. So I brought up the hot end plate from Stewart's on shape page, modified it in Fusion 360. I'd already tweaked it a little bit, so all I had to do was rotate the hot end assembly 45 degrees so that it was parallel to the belt, add some supports, print it up, and test it. Belt adhesion was amazing, and the back side of the print looked really good. The front side was crap because the nozzle was scraping the print all the time it went up and down. So I filed the nozzles twice and was getting decent results. I decided that I didn't really want to file all my nozzles. So time to try 22 and a half degrees and belt adhesion is really good. The only print I had problems with was an object who had a pointy uh, bit for the start. Everything else has been succeeding. To my delight, it's still printing the 90 degree overhangs in the air without problem. I hope this helps and have a great day.